1986 Aliens is considered to be among the greatest films of the 1980s and both is one of the best science fiction or action films and one of the best sequels ever made. It has also received a number of awards and nominations, including an Academy Award nomination for Best Actress for Weaver at the time when the science fiction genre was generally overlooked. It's been 36 years, let's have a look back at the original cast of the movie and see what they've been up to now. Though best remembered by science fiction fans for his portrayal of Kyle Reese in The Terminator and as Dwayne Hicks in Aliens, American actor Michael Bean is also recognized for his many action movie roles during the 90s. His latest appearance was as Ian in the 11th season of the AMC horror series The Walking Dead. Born on July 31, 1956, Bean is now 66 years old. Canadian actor William Hope played the hapless commanding officer of the Colonel Marines, Lieutenant Gorman. Though he has appeared in some movies since, including Hellbound, Hellraiser 2, The Saint, and XXX, Hope has enjoyed a lot of success in recent years as a voice actor for the children's TV show Thomas and Friends. He is now 67 years old. Known for his works in various science fiction, action, and horror films, Bishop in the Alien film franchise was still the most standout role of Lance Henriksen. Henriksen has enjoyed a wide-reaching acting career in Aliens, starring in movies like Near Dark, Pumpkinhead, Head Target, Tarzan, and more. Born on May 5, 1940, the actor is 82 years old as of now. Arguably the most memorable of the Space Marines featured in Aliens, Jeanette Goldstein's role as Jeanette Vasquez was her first film role, and it won her a Saturn Award. Goldstein went on to appear in other movies, including Star Trek, Generations, and Titanic. The actress, now 62, is currently the proprietor of a large cup bra specialty store called Jeanette Bras. Best remembered for his role as Private Drake in Aliens, American actor Mark Rolston has had quite a busy acting career since. He appeared in movies like Lethal Weapon 2, Robocop 2, The Shawshank Redemption, and more. Rolston was born on December 7, 1956, which makes him 65 years old as of now. In Aliens, actor Rico Ross starred as the supporting role of Private Frost. Ross, now 63, appears in various commercials, as well as TV shows aired throughout the United States. Cynthia Dale Scott is an actress best known for portraying her first film role as Dietrich in Aliens, for which she began to receive recognition. Sadly, her filmography after Aliens only contains an episode of 1987 TV series Mr. Belvedere, Invasion Earth, The Aliens Are Here, 1988, and 1991's Rush. American actress Colette Hitler, who starred on films, theater, and television, is best known for her role as Corporal Pharaoh in Aliens. Appearing in Aliens actually marked the end of Hitler's career. She instead chose to focus on theater, and now has two teenage children. The role of Private Spunk Mayor in Aliens was the first acting role of Canadian actor Daniel Cash. He is now 63 years old and still active in the industry, appearing in movies and directing short films. American actor and singer Al Matthews is best known for his appearance as Gunnery Sergeant's opponent in Aliens, the role which he reprised 27 years later, providing the voice for the video game Aliens Colonel Marines. He died on September 22, 2018, aged 75. Although the role of Private Hudson was the stereotypical fall guy, Bill Paxton's performance was so memorable that his acting career since has flourished. 
He went on to notch appearances in some of the biggest blockbusters of the 90s, including Twister, Apollo 13, and Tombstone. Sadly, the American actor and filmmaker passed away on February 25, 2017, following a stroke he suffered during heart surgery. He was 61 years old. In the 1986 film Aliens, actor Tip Tipping starred as Private Crow. Sadly, he died on February 5, 1993, aged 34, in a parachuting accident while filming for the BBC documentary Series 999. British actor and stuntman Trevor Steedman is best known for his role as Private Wierzbowski in the Aliens film. Steedman died of complications from a stroke on June 25, 2016, at the age of 62. The role as Van Leeuwen, a member of the board reviewing Ripley's competence, was played by Paul Maxwell. The Canadian actor who worked mostly in British cinema and television, in which he was usually cast as American characters. Maxwell passed away on December 19, 1991, at the age of 70. Following his success as Detective Jeffrey Friedman in Beverly Hill Cops, Paul Reiser took on the role of the villainous Carter Burke in Aliens. He has continued to work steadily in Hollywood while also releasing a string of books. As of now, the actor, comedian, and television writer is 66 years old. Carrie Henn was chosen from 500 hopefuls for the role of Rebecca Jordan, aka Newt, despite having no previous acting experience. Though she loved her experience making the movie and even won Saturn Award for her role, Carrie never pursued an acting career, instead becoming a teacher. She is now 46 years old. Arguably the most successful thespian of the Aliens cast, Sigourney Weaver received nominations for the Academy Award and Golden Globe Award for Best Actress for her role of Ellen Ripley. An influential figure in science fiction and popular culture, Weaver was voted number 20 in Channel 4's countdown of the 100 greatest movie stars of all time, being one of only two women in the top 20. Born on October 8, 1949, she is now 72 years old. What do you think about our video today? Leave a comment to let us know and don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button to support our channel. Thank you so much for watching. See you soon.